this is a classical view of presence of supernumerary that cause delay eruption of one tooth. We did panoramic x-ray which revealed that there is radio-opaque mass located under the cingulum of the upper right central incisor. Supplemented periapical film was done revealed that there is a radio-opaque mass located under the cingulum of the central incisor which caused its delayed eruption. So our diagnosis was very small odontome located in the central area and it is, its effect is delayed eruption of the central incisor which needs quick intervention. So we made elliptical excision on the crest of the ridge. Through the excision we did, I insert a tweezer to remove this small odontome. This is the small odontome contained mainly of enamel tissue as it appears in the x-ray. After that we need to make a curettage to clean the granulation tissue to create a pathway of eruption. The next step is to be sure that there is enough space for the eruption of this central incisor. So one question here arises. The eruption of, the, of this central incisor will take time. How we are going to preserve the pathway of eruption from healing until the complete eruption of this central incisor? We construct a space maintainer for the missing tooth with acrylic post which inserted in the pathway of eruption and every now and then we decrease this post by grinding it until the eruption of the central incisor. The aim of this action is to prevent the healing of the pathway of eruption. It took about six months after removal of the odontome until the complete eruption of the upper right central incisor.